Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to another Shoe Snob unboxing video series, One Take Wonder. Here we are with <coughs> something new, something kind of the same, but different. That is another pair, I don't know, I'll show you this box of CNES shoes. That is the Vietnamese made brand that's kind of based in Singapore who does more of the international distribution, but Vietnamese made shoes. This is another one of their hand welted line shoes, which I recently showed, but this one is different and I'm gonna, sh well, by the title you're gonna know before I say anything, so I might as well just get out with it. But this is a crocodile pair, also Norwegian welted. So the model is called Rolf, the color is called navy and the size is a 40 which uh, is the same as the last shoe and fits me well remember cns run a little large i'm usually 40 and a half and or uk six and a half us seven and a half so i take a half size down from my normal size and they're fit still generous but <clears throat> i don't know if i can i can do another half size now so let us take a look at these beautiful shoes. Now, just like in the last uh, video, I had mentioned that these shoes had gone around the world and back as they were presented in several trunk shows. And one of the shoe um, things broke off, which is what it is. So, uh, anyway. Let's take a look at these beauties. <clears throat> Lovely pair of single monks with some beautiful shape. Norwegian stitch. This is a part of their hand welted line in a beautiful crocodile, <coughs> crocodile patina in a blue color that they call navy but the most impressive is the price which is very impressive now i know that a lot of excuse me i i know that a lot of it, exotics are actually farmed from this side of the world so i do imagine they are getting the exotic leathers at a very reasonable price unlike what you pay for say in a louisiana farmed alligator or crocodile which are gonna be a lot more expensive so let's take a look it's a beautiful shoe i really like the last it's a little bit pointier than i normally wear but i think it's it's elegant um it's got a great shape i think the norwegian stitch and the kind of protruding welt helps to offset its pointiness again let's take a look the finishing here is top notch to be honest it's very impressive i love the waist the waist is nice and thin but not incredibly thin and i think they do a good job and that's part part of that is the unique sole that they've done I call it the high heel stiletto sole because that's what it looks like to me. <laughs> but, you know, it's obviously a play on the fiddle back on the viola. <clears throat> but here they kind of like take out the a layer of leather, which also makes the waist naturally thinner. <clears throat> I think it's clever. I think it's cool. It's different. Always nice to kind of differentiate yourself. At the same time, they do this very interesting little v in v notch in the heel again beautiful beautiful details it's always it's always nice to see how a brand differentiates themselves from everybody else i think cns has done a good job they're working their way towards that i know in the beginning there was some inspiration a lot of models look like models from elsewhere but now they're coming into their own this even this single monk is very cool it has like a little saddle piece right here to create one side of it. So in, in reality, it could be, well, could be portrayed as a saddle shoe on the outside because the inside is just one piece. But would have been cool if that was also kind of like a saddle piece on that side too. Either way, 
it's a nice model very beautiful um, I, th I don't even recall if I told you the price but it's incredible and it's only 1500 USD hand welted 1500 fully alligator Norwegian stitch hand welted shoe for only $1,500 it's impeccable <coughs> it's scary to be honest it's scary that you can get value that good at that price so let's just take a look solitaire hand sewn well constructing crafted in Saigon I think this was also the same thing in my last pair just wanted to see if there was any kind of difference can see the hand welted marks on the insole can feel them as well when you see little dimples on the insole it's a good indication of it being hand welted because that's the pulling of that uh, of that thread there to create those little dimples in the in the uh, sorry I'm just um, I'm just remembering my time making shoes, to be honest. <laughs> Pulling of the thread is also the all that you do to create the holes in the, uh, <coughs> in the rib there to be able to sew on the welt and the upper. Beautiful shoe. I really like it. I love blue, obviously. My favorite. Not one of my, my favorite colors. So, lovely shoe. I love the, the patina. It's very elegant. Especially if, you know, for a factory style patina, they're crushing it here. Um, great stuff. It's really, there's no bad I can say. Finishing is great. Shape is nice. Last is nice. <clears throat> Sizing is the only tricky thing with CNS. Like I said, I take a 40. These are still generous. I'm not sure if I could take another half size down. They fit, they're, but they're an elongated fit. You know, there's definitely space. So um definitely look to take a, a half to a full size down depending on how you like your shoes to fit um wow it's crazy there's even a subtle super subtle unless my eyes are playing tricks on me doesn't look fully straight um <clears throat> these reflections are getting there, but it looks like there's a super subtle pitch on it very very subtle um nonetheless beautiful stuff <clears throat> now CNES well, you're not going to see a ton of exotics straight on the website but bear in mind they can do made to order as well so you know this is just a template for you and I'm pretty sure they can I'm pretty sure this is obviously you know crocodiles don't come blue so this is crust which means they can make this in other colors so re remember template but the world is your oyster here. Now, I'm not sure, to be honest, if Made to Order has a different, I'm sure we'll have a different upcharge, but again, $1,500 for hand-welted crocodile single monks with Norwegian stitching on it is pretty darn impressive. So even if you're paying a couple hundred bucks more for Made to Order, it's, I'd say you're still getting a steal when considering any other brand is gonna charge triple that at least maybe double double to triple and that's just for you know small brands get into you know big brands they're going to charge you four or five times more so beautiful stuff another maker you can get uh what appears to be nice exotic leather hand welted and incredible pricing I'm almost trying to see what cool things CNES will do in 2023 because they hit it real hard in 2022. So anyway, I hope you've enjoyed. Thank you as always for tuning in. Definitely check them out. I'll leave you the links. If you're looking for some cool exotic leathers, here's your answer. Wishing everybody a great day and thanks as always for tuning in. Take care. Bye-bye.